Hey guys, it's Rebecca again. Um, you're probably going to get two or three videos today. It's my day off and uh, it's been a while since I've had lots of things to talk about. So, um, I think first off, um, I'm actually, I'm not one that usually does product reviews, but um, last time I went in to get a checkup with my surgeon and the nurse, they released me and they said to go ahead and you can try cereal. Um, as long as it had under three grams of sugar. I was having a real hard time finding one that I liked. Um, Cheerios obviously is the number one that you can buy, but you have to get the regular Cheerios. So I was just looking and looking and, you know, I used to love cereal and ever since I started getting you know, ready for the surgery, I haven't had any. And, and I thought, well, Let's see what I can find. Well, I was at our local grocery store, which in this area is Schnucks. Um, I also shop at an Aldi's, which is kind of a discount warehouse type um, store. But mo but the, the main things that you can't really get at those kind of stores, I get from Schnucks. Anyway, um, I was wandering through this cereal aisle, which of course is the one whole aisle for cereals. And pulling things off the shelf and looking at the bet labels and... I know, trying to figure out what one I want to try, um, because I don't really eat a whole lot of carbs at all, and I know cereal would fall under that, but if I got something whole grain that had good fiber, I, I would be okay, um, and that would also help keep things from um, her stopping up, let's put it that way. Um, so I had a lot of that problems at the very beginning um, after surgery, and now it's not so bad. Um, Anyway, the product review that I, I actually bought a cereal and you know, I'm not really big on labels, you know, brand names necessarily. I go, it tastes good. But anyway, I found, um, the cereal that I wanted to try and it's called the South Beach Diet Lightly Sweetened Whole Grain Cereal. And what's really good about it is it says it's 210 calories per serving. A serving, of course, is a cup and a fourth, which I've never seen a serving of anything as a cup and a fourth. Um, I can get maybe a quarter of that in. I could have maybe a half a cup max. But if, okay, for example, if I could do a full cup and a fourth, um, it's, only, it's got less than one gram of fat, um, eight grams of dietary fiber, which is apparently really good, and only three grams of sugar, which that's not bad. Um, but they're toast to call toasted wheats with cinnamon flavor, and they're almost like um, what are those called? Mini wheats, sort of. Um, no frosting or anything, but on the inside, it's got like a cinnamony filling, and they were actually pretty good. Um, but like I said. Um, I, I can't do the full serving. I can do maybe a half a cup, um, five, six, maybe seven little biscuits. They, they're real tiny biscuits, you know, and, but they're really good. And I, I noticed that, cause I, I have a problem eating first thing in the morning. I really do. I try eggs just didn't sit well. I like the eggs. I don't get me wrong. I use the egg beaters and, um, I'll do it on a little, a little egg beater omelet with some cheese maybe, or some you know, maybe mushrooms or something, but, um, I would have to wait until like two or three hours after I woke up because first thing in the morning, I just couldn't do it. I tried and I couldn't, um, I'd get a yogurt in and that was what I've been eating for weeks now. And, you know, she had mentioned trying to some, maybe some cereal. So this is what I found. Um, another plus about this cereal is it's six, it's got six grams of protein per serving. And if you add that to skim milk, which has got a nine, that's actually a pretty good breakfast serving of protein, you know. And then of course I have my protein um, tea drink that I make, and I kind of nurse that for a couple hours all morning long. Um, so I thought that that was actually pretty good. I was pretty excited about that. So um, here's my first little uh, review that I kind of rambled on about, but. Um, you know, maybe try it if you're wanting to try a little bit of a cereal. Um, I, I don't really eat a whole lot of other carbs, so that having a small amount of carbs in the first thing in the morning 
actually isn't that all that bad. Um, it actually seems to be boosting the weight loss, and I'll do the weight loss um, total this morning on my next video, which will be my actual 11-week um, update. All right? I'll, I hope you guys try it, and let me know what you think, okay? Talk to you soon. Bye.